Okay, um, hello, uh, welcome to this online class. Um, so this is a video that I will show you how you can go through or navigate through um, Canvas uh, because we're going to have an online class. Uh, so I think it's important that um, understand the structure of how the class is organized. Uh, so because I'm teaching three classes this semester, so I'm going to use just one uh, uh, class on Canvas as a demo. Um, so for the other classes, the structure is uh, similar. Okay, uh, so basically each week you will have multiple items that you need to finish. And you have to finish all the items and you have to finish all the items following the order. So for example, uh, in week one, so the first one, is an introduction to syllabus video. Uh, you can see that you have to view this item and then you can move on to the next item. So if you click the first one and that will um, open a YouTube video that that's me that talking about uh, the syllabus. So please watch this video and as it is very important. And once you have done that, if you go back to the module, you can see, OK, so now this item is checked so that you have viewed this video. And then you had following to finish the second item and which is a PDF document. And it is required that you have to read the syllabus again in detail. OK, so that's also very important to understand the content of this class. And for this class, you need to download a software. So I provided this URL, and I just want to make sure that you know where it is. Um, but for different classes, uh, the URL might be different. And I also include another video that talking about how to use WebEx, because we are host uh, virtual office hours by using WebEx. So please do watch this video. OK, and you can say, OK, so now this is viewed. Uh, so there's a check mark here. So now you can continue to the next item. So uh, in this case, that's the introduction of using AWS Educator. So depending on which class you, you have enrolled, so uh, you may need to watch different uh, videos or different documents. OK, so the next item is an assignment. Uh, so that actually that will most of the videos will be look like this in the future. So uh, this is a video that talking about Slack. Uh, the only different is that so there are several embedded questions in the video so that you have to watch the video and you have to answer those questions successfully. So you can see that you have to pass a score of 100 uh, to finish this item. Uh, don't be scared about <laughs> that score. So it's those are very, very easy questions and you can retry multiple times. OK, so let's look at the, our first one. So that is a video. So that's talking about Slack and you can just watch that one. OK. So you can see there are tiny dots on the timeline. So those are the questions that you need to answer. So when you uh, reach, when you are watching the videos and when you see those uh, dots, the video will be paused and there will be a question and you should answer that question and based on what you have watched uh, from this video. OK, so let's see how the question will look like. OK, so here you can see the video is paused and you have a question and you should answer this question. Uh, don't worry if you answer the wrong question. So because you can, you can always retry it. OK, so you can retry it or you can show the solution. So you have to. So let's see. OK, so if you choose the right question, great. And you can continue.
Okay, so here we reached the second question. And let's click that one. And let's just click the right one. And continue. Okay, so now you have answered all the uh, questions and uh, successfully answered all the questions. Uh, it is important that you need to click this star so that you can submit your quest your uh, your answers. So uh, it is also the at the end of this video. However, if you think you are you're ready, you can just click the star. Okay, so you can see you have answer two questions and you can submit your answer so it is very important that don't miss this part so i submit my answer you can see your answer has been submitted and if you check your grades okay so you can see for this assignment you get 100 grade okay 100 score and now if you go back to module so because you got 100, so it is finished. Okay. So that is the videos that have embedded questions. Uh, the next is uh, assignments. So we have weekly labs or we have some uh, assignments that you need to submit something or you need to, you need to do something. Uh, in this case, you need to do something in Slack. So for example, this is the assignment. Okay, uh, so for this assignment, you need to join the Slack workspace and change your name to your name on Canvas and post a short introduction. So you, uh, so there's nothing you need to submit on Canvas. So you have to do that one uh, in Slack in this case. And remember that the deadline, so you have to finish that one before that deadline. And once you're done, you can mark that one as done. Okay, so because for this assignment, you don't have anything to submit on Canvas, uh, you just need to do everything in Slack. However, if there are something that you need to submit, like the labs, that weekly labs, you need to submit a lab report, then you just upload your report on Canvas. So here, suppose I have done this assignment, I, I did join the workspace and also put an introduction, and I just mark this one as done. And then I go to my module. Uh, if you check your grades, you can see it is still zero because um, that assignment, I will give you the grades. So I will check whether or not you really joined your Slack or whether or not you really submit your lab report and also if you did everything correct. So I will give you the grade. Uh, but you, if you go to modules and you can see, okay, so that is done on your part, okay? Uh, so make sure that you, you for those assignments, those labs, make sure you submit everything before the deadline, you finish everything before the deadline. And in order to submit, um, finish those uh, labs or the assignment, you need to watch all those uh, videos, all those materials that um, uh, uh, in that weekly module, and then you can finish those assignments. And once you're done for all the week one modules and the week two module will be unlocked. So in this case, because I haven't posted anything in, um, in week two, so it is empty. But if there are something that in week two, so it will, uh, it will showing up here. Okay, so that is how uh, we navigate on Canvas. Again, if, if you have questions, please ask me in Slack or you can come to my uh, office hours on WebEx, or you can send me email.